Hey, what's going down guys? Jared Bronstein here. Today's my last day for the week, but if you wanna connect with me, check out my personal YouTube channel. It's just my name. I'll still pop in here every now and then, but we gotta get right into this story. NASA is legitimately planning on flying a spaceship directly into the sun. Obviously no one will be on board because that'll be just suicide, but I'm sure you guys are wondering why they'd build the spacecraft just to completely demolish it. Well, it turns out NASA wants to get more information on the sun. By doing this mission, it will help them understand the sun's outer atmosphere. And according to NASA, I will quote, the spacecraft will explore the sun's outer atmosphere and make critical observations that will answer decades old questions about the physics of how stars work. The resulting data will improve forecasts of major space weather events that impact life on Earth, as well as satellites and astronauts in space. So what I got from that is uh, it affects us here on Earth. I'm not really sure how, but I mean, you heard what NASA said, and I trust them, so it's legit. The mission will be going down in 2018, or should I say, going up. Wow, that was really cringy, I'm sorry guys. It's believed the Solar Pro Plus, which is the technical name for the spaceship, will be able to withstand 1,377 Celsius degrees, and for those of you in the US, that's about 2,500 degrees Fahrenheit. So it's really hot. The name they're giving the spacecraft is Parker Solar Probe, which comes from solar scientist Eugene Parker. It will be crafted with a carbon composite heat shield to help withstand the heat of the sun, because in case you guys didn't know, the sun is really hot. As always, you guys gotta drop me a comment down below with your thoughts on this. Is it worth it for NASA to spend however much money they're spending on the spacecraft just to destroy it? I mean, it's in the name of science, so maybe. Let me know in the comments down below. I gotta read some comments now, so let's do this. It's Toby's GFX and more said, hi Jared. You are a potato. You guys are all potatoes. But yeah, I guess we all are. We're like the potato family. Bipolar Unicorn29 said, Hi Jared, is there any room for IO Teen Edition? It's a great question. Maybe we'll start a channel where it's like just teenagers running it and, and you guys could be in it and do it. Richard the Gamer said, Jared, could I be in the video? You're damn right you can be, Richard. You're in the video. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you soon. I'm Jared Bronstein, and have a great day.